guys, what's up? This is Luke Sakata over here. It's been a while since I last did a tutorial, but today it's kind of like a special, a little special request since um, to buy the advice of IMP because she didn't really understood what I really meant by uh, using a border. So uh, I'm gonna teach you all how to actually make a border on the video you want and um, make the sprite move according to the video itself so what you gotta do is that you gotta have a fully rendered video over here like myself you can pick any video you like let's say if you made a special video for yourself or whatever or you wanna make a fan made video like this one this is already made before what you do is that you pull it onto the timeline over here and the next thing you want to do is you go to the media generators and you pull black over so once you pull black over as you can see the whole thing is covered right? what you want to do is that you adjust the black to the length of the video and you want to go to video effects and go to cookie cutter and what you want to find is this square center white border so you want to pull it over onto the solid color and you'll get this on your screen so for me is uh it's up to you whether you like to do border or not because i don't really do border and uh, in order to make it look like a border that's surrounding your video, what you want to do is that instead of cutaway all the section, you do cutaway section and then you get this. So how to make it like a border? Very simple. Just drag the repeat X to 10 and you get this. You can adjust the sides and the center. Well, for me, I will keep it like that. So you can get this. And what you wanna do is that you would wanna get your sprite, which for me I will get my own sprite. And adjust the same thing according to the video. So what you wanna do is you want it small. You just go the pen and crop, which is this one, this button over here. Click in this one, click in this one here, then pen and crop. What you do is that you wanna make it smallest since the video you show you the very smallest. Uh, now, what you do is that you adjust it from here. This is the first keyframe over here. And to the end of the keyframe, So at the end, what you would see is that you would see your sprite moving. And the best example. over here track motion and what you do is you click track motion you can adjust the size of how big and small you want it to be let's say you want it to be this small and then you can adjust it here 
it's the same over here as the keyframes it's up to you on how which way you want to do it so you can always do it by keyframe or either by uh, pen crop it works either way so this, this is the end of the tutorial I'll see. so thank you very much everyone i hope that I've helped you if you are playing to do this kind of videos that requires the sprite to move around um, if there's any questions you can leave it in the comments